Shalom Akin for Sol Prin Goria, Hawapa Hashim Yawa Shaba Hashim Kakwadash, the Bonifas Mill song, and such and select. What I'm going to get into is what is love according to the scriptures, man. The people say they love they love so called Jesus, right? Which Trinity means you have a shy. They say, Oh yeah, I love Jesus, but I love God. Well how well the scripture says tells you how do you love the most high, but how you love you have a shy. Yeah, people these people don't do it, man. Now it's a real it's a real sim it's a real sim oh, it's, like, it's a real simple scripture, man. I'm sorry, I, John fourteen In fact, yeah, I'll just start at verse 15, get straight to the point. And read his words, Yahweh Shai. If you love me, if you love Yahweh Shai, right, the world, 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 you're going to be called Jesus Christ. If you love Yahweh Shai, right, you keep my commandments. This is it right there, right, simple, and fucking clear, man. If you love Yahweh Shai, keep the commandments. I'm jumped all to verse 21. It reads, He that have my commandments and keepeth them, he is he it is that loveth me. And he that loveth me shall love shall be love of my father, and I'll love him, and will manifest myself to him. Right this is right right simple, right clear, right there. That if you love if you love you well, it'll be how bro, it'll be how shy. You wanna get love on the most side, you gotta keep you gotta keep the the law such commandments, bro. So it shows like, hey, we keep the commandments for a purpose, man. I'm going to verse 23. And it reads, Yahushua answered and said unto him, If a man love me, he will keep my words, and my fathers will love him, and he will come unto him, and make our abode with him. He that loveth me, not keep my sayings, and not and the word which ye hear is not mine, but the Father which sent me. These things have spoken unto you, being present with you. So it says it right there, bro. Right, right, clear and simple, man. Hey, I gotta keep the commands of Moses. I gotta keep you. How was I word, bro? And what you how was I said? If you love me, keep my commandments. The people don't understand that. Hey, you're supposed to follow such, follow the law, such commandments of the Most High. You know, not not all you could do whatever the hell you want, bro. You can't do all that, man. You see, like, so all you can do, you can worship your house, however you want, or work for Jesus Christ, however you want, bro. All you gotta say is, I believe, I believe that Jesus Christ is the only personal Savior. You automatically say it, bro. No. That shows that you love Jesus. You love, you love God. You love Jesus, bro. Yep, you're not keeping the word. I'm read it. I'm read it again, real quick. Just have, because it says it right there, clear and simple. Honestly, man. Back to verse, this is John 14, verse 15, and it reads, If you love me, keep my commandments. It says right there in simple, bro. Right there, fucking simple, man. If you love me, keep my commandments. We're still under this lost this camera as well as I, bro. It never changed. It never changed. Yet yeah, people think that, oh, well, we're now in a new age, this and that. As implied to us no more. No, it still applies to you, man. There's multiple accounts, even in the New Testament, it says, hey, keep the law, statutes, and commandments of the Most High. People don't understand what is sin, bro. People don't understand that, man. They think sin is just the, the Ten Commandments, that's it, but no, it's every single one of them. In fact, I'm gonna get this real quick. This is Matthew, I'm gonna get this first. This is Matthew 5 verse 17 and reads, Think not I come to destroy the law, or prophets, think not I come to destroy, but to fulfill. Her blood is to you, and I read, read, read this multiple times, man. Yet people still don't get it, people still don't understand it. You're supposed to keep the law, statutes, and commandments of the Most side. Her blood is to you, it's a heaven or a past, one job or one throw shall know I craft from passion of love to all be filled. Whosoever therefore shall break one of the least commandments, even the least commandment, bro. And teach men so? Should be called the least in the kingdom of heaven. But, but whosoever shall do and teach them, the same should be called great. And the same should be called great in the kingdom of heaven. 
So that would teach, that would teach, these pastors teach. They teach you to break the laws of Shimon Mosa. You can do whatever you want. Just go go of your heart. Not just say, oh, go of your heart, go of your mind, and let God do this. No, bro. But what said? What sure said, man? Like that real quick. I guess real quick. Do that whole fire of hardship, man. Hey, don't do that shit, bro. That shit gonna lead you unto death, man. Come on, I got it right here. This is Jeremiah 17, verse 9, and it reads, The heart is deceitful above all things and desperately wicked. Your emo because all what it is is your emotions, man. It's deceitful above all things and is desperately wicked. Who can know it? Because remember, we're living in a carnal world, bro. And we're taught to follow your heart, follow this and that, man. Basically saying, hey, do what the fuck you want. And said, you may have to look. Yeah, because we, that whole follow your heart shit, nothing of logic, man. Nothing of like, alright. Well, yeah, I wanted this, but it's gonna happen, that's gonna happen, this is gonna happen. Because that's what, that's basically what it is, bro. If you follow your heart shit, man. It just creates more wickedness. It just creates wickedness. Because so what? Let me read it again real quick. This is the heart of deceitful above all things. And it's desperately wicked. Who can know it? It's A, bro. Fuck all that heart shit, man. You wanna know what love is? Love, according to the last touch comes on the most high. It's giving the commandments, bro. That, Akim. Oh, that's in short. Of all praise and glory to Yahweh, Baha'i Shimi, Yahweh Shai, Baha'i Shimi, Kadash. That's okay. Shalom.